Hi, my name is Theodore Watson uh, with Design.io and uh, I wanted to show a bit of an R&D project that we've been working on at the moment. Uh, it involves an iPod Touch and trying to use the gyroscope in the iPod Touch to track the motion of a skateboard. Um, the project is called SkaterViz and we got started by strapping it to the bottom of a very old school skateboard and doing some tricks and some testing, um, including trying to skate. Uh, and then when we got the data back and it was, seemed very promising. Uh, we got the gyroscope and the accelerometer data um, and it looked like it could work. So uh, we went a little further and started developing the SkaterViz software. Um, we knew we were going to need some professional help when it came to, comes to doing the tricks. So we uh, got in touch with Frankie Nash from Orchard Skate Shop in Boston and Thomas Kramer from Tom Skate Shop in Amsterdam. Um, and with their help, uh, we uh, recorded some runs and uh, we'll show you some of those runs right now. So this is uh, Frankie Nash um, in Boston and you can see the, the motion data being augmented over the video, which we thought would be really interesting to show. Um, and so you can see some of his tricks and also the rotation arrows and the rotation degrees that are calculated. And then we have some runs from Thomas in Amsterdam. One of the cool things was is that we recorded audio from the iPod mic as well and we can actually uh, play that audio back in time with the run. But I'll just turn it off for now. Um, <coughs> here you can see a flip with just along one axis. Um, and you can see the arrows detecting that. We can also turn on slow play, which slows down the playback of the video and the playback of the trick just at the moment when a trick is being detected. We also have some different views for looking at the data. Um, this view allows us to look at it sort of independent of the video and also you can see underneath the graph showing the force of the tricks um, both in Y um, positive and negative, so you can kind of see actually that uh, these areas correlate to where the jumps occur. Just show you guys a few more tricks. We're also running some shaders over the video, so you actually kind of see. Uh, the skater highlighted a little bit more and maybe it's good to finish with this grind. <coughs> anyway, so the project's very much work in progress but we're really excited with it so far and uh, yeah, we'll stay tuned for kind of more from us on this. Um, and big thanks to Thomas and Frankie um, and uh, yeah, stay tuned.